Hi, my name is Shamsida. The proudest moment of my life is when I found out that I'm brave enough to actually leave my previous job and really just go on my own as a photographer. I've always loved cooking. Malay cooking is very important to me because it brings me back to my roots. I am half Minang and half Boyanese. I'm very proud of my heritage, very proud of being Malay and especially Malay cuisine. Yeah, and I want to have a, a channel on a social media platform for me to teach younger people on cooking Malay food. I understand how tedious it is to cook Malay food. For me, I like how things are done very quickly and fast in Western cuisine. So instead of fusioning off the flavours, I fusion Western techniques with Malay flavours, Malay cooking to just shorten the amount of cooking time and you'll get like probably 90% of the flavour of the original Malay cooking and that's good enough. It just gets people excited to cook Malay food. You know, you don't get that, oh, it's going to take me half a day, I don't have the time, I'm going to be from work, I miss my mother's cooking, I miss my late grandmother's cooking, you know, I'm like, why didn't you get the recipes from them? Why didn't you learn? Uh, you know, I don't know how to cook. <laughs> so yeah, I mean, just get excited about it and they can explore the techniques, explore the flavours to eventually get 100% of the food that their mother used to make. Yeah, just that. Yeah. Blender at home. <laughs> huh? Are you serious? Yeah. How have you been cooking? Ah, you know you can order the paste online now. Oh, okay. <laughs> so you cheated. Yes. Yeah. I'm Yati, and today um I learned how to cook laksa with shams, and it's totally from scratch, which I never done before. Like, <laughs> I cut uh, onion, you know. <laughs> She cooked first time cutting onion, peeling an onion. I'm very impressed. It was a good experience and I think I did 10 upon 10. <laughs> I will give it 10 upon 10. You just want to make sure that it really smells like laksa. I haven't even cooked eh. Yeah. So oh. the curry mask the, the smell of the fish. Now I feel like professional already. <laughs> Before this, I always tried cooking using uh, instant paste but um, the satisfaction is different because you do it from scratch and everything is like fresh so yeah, this is something fun She is actually younger than me then if she can cook better than me then it's a shame on me <laughs> then I must do better, right? <laughs> so I think, yes, I think it will be like a motivation like someone like her who can cook so um, I will probably like want to try cooking for myself. Today onwards, I'm going to buy a blender. <laughs> Solves all your problems. Yes. In winning MasterChef, I can spread my influence on Malay cuisine and teach people who are not Malays even, you know, how to cook traditional Malay dishes. I mean, hopefully I win MasterChef. I mean, I'm, I am going to win MasterChef, I think. <laughs>